it's always kind of been my rule. I try and get to work 20 to 30 minutes before that staff meeting to get in, get my coffee, uh, or two cups of coffee. We have a 7.30 staff meeting with the whole staff where Coach Walker talks to us. And then usually after that, the offense and defense break up and we'll have a defensive staff meeting and that can last from about sometimes an hour, hour and 15 minutes. And once that's over, I'll begin my work for the day. Uh, I'm responsible for the first and second down passing game. And uh, after we've scripted the calls that we want on our pass cards, I'll come back in here and draw the defenses to the cards that I already drew over the weekend. Uh, I have a number of past studies I do, whether I'm studying looks that they give, it's a, if it's a stack look or if it's a, a cluster look, whether I've got to study different routes. Um, are they a deep ball team? Are they a quick team? And I'll study that all the way up through our meetings. I usually watch practice again and detail my notes, come up with my checklist, and uh, talk to Coach Littlejohn, our other DB coach, about what we need to work on. And they hit him on that today. And then once position meetings start, we're in with the DBs. Feels productive to get up early this morning, right? Get to work. Going over, like I said, if we have practice, going over the practice corrections. Devin, eight, completed 505. One's up! One's up! In auto, jog on! After that, obviously practice starts. Come on, transition now, stick it and go! I focus on the safeties, but Coach Littlejohn and I work together coaching the entire secondary. So from the start of practice through the end, my total focus is on our secondary. Shoot and go through, no missed tackles this week! So I'm, I'm constantly focused on those guys, whether it's in stretch, individual, or team making sure those guys are doing the right thing and letting them play as well. Just run with them. Just run with them. Yep, you got me. I'm in the booth during the games, talking to Coach Walker for the most part the whole game. Uh, we developed this system at UCLA. He brought it to UCLA from the Redskins. Coach Walker put his touch on it at UCLA and involved me. And We have a great headset relationship during game day. Uh, I'm responsible for calling out the offense's personnel to him. Two I got receivers on. 11, coach. Stay with 11. Watch a run here. Uh, also, we're, uh, responsible for any tips and alerts we may have by personnel and down and distance. And then I watch the secondary and note, watch the pass concept they ran, see what our defense did versus that pass concept, and then make any adjustments to the secondary that we need to make. I'm usually a midnight guy. 11.30 to midnight would be the time. I'm not a big time guy. I try and get out of here when my work is done. You know, I don't like to put just, oh, I'm going to leave here at this time. I'm leaving when my work is done. Uh, Greg Williams always told me at the Redskins, don't ever put your head down on your pillow until you know your work is done. I think about that every single night. <laughs>